Well, good day, model railroaders. I have a bit of a question I want to ask myself. And if I have a question, then maybe you guys have the same question. If you take plaster cloth, well, obviously you've got to dip it in water to put it up. On your layout, the part where you want to put scenics, scenic details. And plaster cloth, that's a good, good base material, right? So cut it up in sheets, dip it in the water, put it on the layout. But what if you added green paint to the water? Would it change the plaster cloth to green instead of white? Well, that's the question I've got. So let's see if it works. Okay, so we got our water in there. wasn't a lot left in this paint jar so just add whatever I can to it should be great The whole idea is to make it green, so I'm going to add quite a bit of green, but not to the point, of course. There we go. Nice and green. Alright, so I'll cut up some strips, and we'll see how this works. Okay, guys, so we got my track all taped off. We got our green water. Let's see what happens. Looks like it's gonna turn it green. I'm starting with longer pieces going to fill up the center area. Another thing I like about the plaster cloth is you get the little ribs and stuff in them. Don't worry about it. Adds texture because nature is not very flat. everybody you've all seen plaster cloth done before so I'm not gonna bore you with that so I'm just gonna keep going and when we get to the last little area I'll show you how it turned out now you shut this thing off with fingers that are covered in plaster should be interesting all right I'll show show you guys in a bit what it's gonna turn out like okay guys just a little bit of an update but green paint in the water plaster cloth is white dip it in green paint and first layer of painting I think is done now this is still pretty wet now I'm halfway to where I want to be so I'm gonna continue on probably by the time I get down to that end this end here will be dry so we'll take a look in a few minutes 
All right, hold on. Okay, guys, I got the area done. As you can see, it is green. Zoom. So I'm going to take the green tape off the track. And we'll have a look at what we're making. Now, eventually, what I want to get in this area is a lot of trees that go right over top of the track. So hold on. Okay, just one final look at it, guys. This is what happens when you put green paint for your plaster cloth. Dip that in there, and it turns green. Perfect. So that's less painting I have to do, less pink, less brown. Plywood prairies are starting to dry up. Takes time to do scenery, but the whole thing is... If you can find a shortcut, why not do it? So, there you go. Put some paint in the water when you're doing plaster cloth. Brown, black, green, whatever color you want to do it. And get her done. Next thing I can do, I guess, show this off is a GoPro Live. See if I can find some trees to stick in this too. All right, guys, bye for now. That was a cool experiment. I thought it worked really good. Let me know in the comments below what you think, if you've done it, and if you're going to start doing it. All right, bye for now, guys. Bye.